सो हाई गाइज आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू अबाउट प्रोजेक्ट नंबर फोर स्क्वायर कैलकुलेटर सो आई हैव ऑलरेडी कम्प्लीटेड माई प्रोजेक्ट एंड नाउ फॉर योर रेफरेंस फॉर योर हेल्प आई एम गोइंग टू डू इट अगेन सो सी आई विल डू माई प्रोजेक्ट विथ एडिशनल गोल वन एंड टू सो हियर येस दिस इज द प्लेस वेर वी आर गोइंग टू मेक चेंजेस एंड दिस इज स्क्रीन वन okay we can name we can give any id i will give as square calculator square calculator i will type you can give any id to this screen so guys to create a app first step is we should know the purpose why we are creating this app and the second um second purpose is uh, design the app and the third point is code the app and fourth point last we should run and see whether the app is working or not so now we are going to start so we are going to design it first and now we are going to take a label and the id of this label is not label 2 label 1 okay and now we are going to write here enter the length of the side of so here we can write it from this text enter the length of the side of and after that we have to take one more label and we will write below this the square in number format so we will take this this is label 2 and now we will text as the square in number format so now we have to take text input from here we can get we will take a text input and in place holder you can write here enter the length because it's written here enter the length so we will also write enter the length now we will take a button and width and the height of this button is 40 see the button height and this text input height are both same so we will also give this height as 40 and here we will write calculate and now we have to take one more label and we will write there label 3 and here we will write area and we will take one more label that label will be blank and this will be as label 4 and we will increase this width to 25 of 50 60 okay and height will be 25 will increase as 65 okay now we will take one more label and we will change to this 5 and we will write here perimeter perimeter and now we will take one more label we will change this to label 6 and we will text as this label will be blank height will be 65 and width will be 25 
now we are going to take yes so now we are one, going to take one more label okay this thing i am doing additional you will write here as uh, label 7 and text i will write number of mangoes are grown number of mangoes are grown on now we will take one more label and we will write here as label 8 and we will text as 25 square unit area 25 square unit area now we will take one more label and this will be label 9 and text will be empty and we will increase this to 25 65 and height will be 25 okay okay so now we are going to take one more label and this will be label 10 and i will write as number of coconuts are grown on so now we are going to take one more label and this will be label 11 and we will, we are going to write 25 square unit area 25 square unit area and now we are going to take one more label here and we are this label will be empty and id will be label 12 and width will be 65 height will be 25 okay so our design part is completed now we will code we, we are going to take on event when this button one when this button one will click so set text set text as label 4 label 4 and we will go on math we will take one multiply by sign and we will we will take this get number on both sides and we will put as id text input 1 this whatever the user will type text input 1 now we will take one more set text and we will give as id label 6 now we are going to take one more multi we will go on math and we will go to take one more multiply by sign and we will take get number and we id will be text input 1 and i will type here 4 now we are going to take one more set text and i will type here label 9 and i will go on math again i will take a multiply by sign now i will go on ui controls then I'm going to take set text, not set text. I will take get number. Get number ID will be text input one. Here I will type six. And now I'm going to take one more set text and ID will be label 12. 
and I will go on math. I will take one more multiply by sign and I will write here 4 and I will run UI control. I will take this get number and the ID will be text input 1. Okay, so our design and code is done. Now we are going to check whether is it is correct or not okay so i will run and see i will type here as 5 calculate yes it's correct i will type two, 10 calculate yes it's coming so we have done our this project now we can rename from here and we will click on save and if we want to uh, submit it, we, we can click on share and we can copy this link and we can go with this and you will see that submit your project. You can just paste that link and submit your project. Okay guys, so if the video was helpful, please like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.